More than 3 million people have signed up to storm Area 51 in September to see them aliens. There's probably not any men in black working with extraterrestrials in the Nevada desert, but what's actually going on at Area 51 is even cooler. The Air Force originally bought Area 51 to test the famous U-2 reconnaissance plane, often the source of UFO sightings during the Cold War. It was later used to develop America's first operational stealth aircraft, the F-117 Nighthawk. The secretive Southwest training ranges have grown significantly over the years, and today they're working on bleeding edge aircraft tech for the US military, like the new B-21 stealth bomber and the X-37B space plane. These ranges also helped to develop the RQ-170 stealth drone used to find Bin Laden and the RQ-180, its successor, of which no pictures exist. Area 51 and its cousins are also crucial to testing a whole host of revolutionary unmanned combat drones to work with our current fighters, the F-35 and F-22. So when the motherships do show up and Bill Pullman leads us into battle, humanity's best chance of victory lies in the aircraft being tested at Area 51 today. What's the coolest thing the Air Force is working on today? Let us know in our poll. Also, let us know what other topics you'd like our scholars to cover in 60 seconds. And be sure to like and subscribe for more research and videos from AEI.